my name is Jennifer Hendricks Black. I make functional pottery, art you can use every day. Today I'm trying a two, new technique called bubble glaze. This was sent to me by my friend Valerie Waddux. I started with just a regular commercial glaze and I thinned it down and then added just one or two drops of dishwashing liquid. Now's the fun part. Remember when you were a kid and you used to blow bubbles in your drink? That's exactly what we're going to do here. As the bubbles pop, they're going to create a circular glaze pattern on our pieces. These pieces already have clear glaze on them. A piece like this so you can see. And you can see as the bubbles pop it's going to create a pattern on the outside of our glaze base. I'm going to go ahead and finish up these pieces and we'll get them in the kiln and see what bubble glaze looks like. Welcome back. Yesterday I tried out bubble glazes for the first time and I thought I'd show you how they turned out. This one turned out pretty good. You've got this great circular bubble pattern within the inside of the bowl. There's another bowl, different color glazes, different color bubbles. I also did a couple bases. These are probably going to take some more experimenting. There's a nice design, just not enough of it. And the final base, this is with the blue bubbles. You get a little bit more of the bubble pattern on this one. So that may be what we're going for. It was fun experimenting with bubble glazes. I'm going to keep trying new ideas and new patterns, and you can check them all out at my website, jenniferhendricksblack.com, or my Facebook page, Jennifer Hendricks Black Ceramic Arts.